The high platy heat treatment disposer is an equipment which uses a completely pollution-free closed method to carry out heat dissolution treatment of troublesome disposable waste. The high platy heat treatment disposer dis differs entirely from current incinerators. To show you just how the high platic is different, let's take a look at each of its functions. First, oil sludge is placed inside the inner kiln of the, the main disposal waste. After insertion of the inner kiln, the bolts are tightened uniformly to seal against leakage of gas or oil during distillation. The main unit is composed of a vacuum kiln and a burning kiln. In this way, the oil sludge has no direct contact with the air at all. Since the sludge can be heated without oxidation, heat dissolution can be carried out simply. Next, the power supply to the boiler, the heater, the blower, and the burner is switched on and is set automatically. When the boiler's automatic start switch is turned on, fuel oil is sent from the service tank and is ignited automatically. This tank processes the waste oil. The oil is purified so that it can be used as fuel oil. The oil burner uses an automatic thermostat this makes it possible for the burner to run so that the heat dissolution is carried out in a constant temperature. Flammable gases are also usable as fuel through the use of a gas burner. To keep the maximum heat dissolution temperature within the 800 to 900 centigrade range, the oil burner has an auto on-off control. After the heat dissolution is completed, the burner stops automatically. At the point when the flammable gases are generated, the blower begins running automatically. Ethane or butane gas is also used with a heat combustion burner. However, after the operation is finished, these gases are used to cool the vacuum kiln. At this point, when the temperature of the combustion chamber reaches 200 centigrade, the blower stops automatically. The oil heat sludge heated in the vacuum kiln is sent to the oil separator tank as a vapor. This tank is composed of a three oil separator chamber. The outer shell has a double wall construction and the water is circulated around the tank to cool the oil vapor and change it back into oil. The oil is then saved. An outlet to remove the oil is located in the bottom of the tank. This oil can be reused as fuel oil. In addition, an access hole for cleaning is provided. This hole is also used for periodic checks. Remaining
cleaning time oil gases are sent to the gas cleaning tank. Cleaning water is put into this tank beforehand up to a constant water level. Air bubbles are fed in from the bottom of the tank. This action cleans the gases and removes the impurities. Then the moisture in the gas from the gas cleaning tank is removed by the gas separator and the gas is used for fuel. This is an underground tank constructed with three sections. This is used for storage of cooling water, water for cleaning gas, and purified oil. When all operations are finished, the inner kiln is overturned. The overturning permits the ash remaining from the heat treatment to be taken out easily. The inner kiln is mounted in an overturning device. It is fastened with wires so that the overturning operation can be carried out safely. This harmless remaining solid formation can also be burnt as solid fuel. After the treated waste has been gasified, it is cooled and liquefied. Also the flammable gases which cannot be liquefied or burned completely in the combustion chamber. There is no smoke in this process so the high smoke stack is not necessary. The Kameda Seisak Sho High Platic Heat Treatment Disposer is an orderless, smokeless, universal disposer, which is truly the 21st century product.